Well, now at 530, starting this summer, LAPD officers making traffic stops will have to turn on their body cameras and explain why that person was being pulled over. A policy change is meant to combat a practice called pretextual police stops, where officers pull over someone and then it escalates into a more serious crime. Well, some people like the move, others don't. Here is CBS 2's Chris Holmstrom. Big changes are coming to the LAPD. In a unanimous decision, the LA Police Commission updated the department's policy on pretextual stops, minor traffic or code violations that can escalate into an investigation of a more serious crime. After conducting an exhaustive investigation and audit, the Inspector General determined that not only was the LA Times report accurate, but also the data showed that pretextual stops has little impact on crime in Los Angeles. I got the Officers will now have to justify on their body camera why they are pulling people over. Council member Marquise Harris Dawson represents District 8, a large portion of South LA. Oh, I've never met uh, African American male, not met very many Latino males, uh, and frankly, others who haven't had the experience of being stopped, not being given a reason, asked a zillion questions. Uh, and frankly, fearing for your life in those situations. The policy will start this summer, and if officers do not comply, they will be forced to undergo training and could be disciplined. The police union says these changes will hinder public safety. We want to come up with ways to reduce biases, and we want reform, but we want it to be fair for our officers, and we want it to actually work. Officer Joe Massey is the director for the Los Angeles Police Protective League. He says a large number of illegal guns are taken out of neighborhoods by traffic and pedestrian stops. The union says last year alone in the Newton Division, officers recovered 817 firearms during 726 incidents. Of those incidents, 699 arrests were made. 507 of them came after traffic stops. This is going to leave those guns, leave those bad drivers on the road, and it's going to hurt people uh, of all communities, regardless of the, your skin color. Paula Minor is with Black Lives Matter LA. She is against pretextual stops, but doesn't think the policy changes will make a difference. We just hope that no additional harm or bad situations occur that end up with someone being injured or murdered. Chris Holmstrom, CBS 2 News.